guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Karina. Click that subscribe button down below if you haven't already and turn on that bell icon that way you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. And today I am going to do a highly requested Trader Joe's grocery haul. So this lined up perfectly because I haven't uploaded a video in a minute, that's my bad. And on my previous grocery haul meal delivery service videos, I had a lot of comments asking for a grocery haul. I don't buy anything fancy, um, I kind of just get like essentials and stuff to last me for the week. So let's go to Trader Joe's. It is literally freezing in here. We love the cheese. Okay guys, so we are now back from Trader Joe's. I always go a little crazy there, especially if I see some newer things that I like that are freshly in stock or if it's something that I've been meaning to try and the past few trips I just haven't gotten it so I'll get it now instead. They were out of like the peach, it's like black tea or it's like peach and black tea like drink or something like that. I got it last week or two weeks ago and they didn't have any of it in stock today. I asked them and they were actually supposed to get a shipment and they didn't end up getting it. So I'm gonna have to check back like tomorrow or in a couple days to see if they finally have it in stock because I'm literally gonna buy all of it because it is so, so good. I'll insert a picture of it right here. That way you guys can see what I'm talking about. If you've tried this, you know that it is literally amazing. And if you haven't tried it, go to your nearest Trader Joe's and try it. So let's get into my little grocery haul. So first are these scalloped chips. They're made with five cheeses, so I thought it'd be interesting. I love chips as snacking. Um, I'm a big snacker, so. And then these chips I got specifically because they're white truffle, and I didn't see these last time that I was in Trader Joe's, but I love anything with truffle, so I'm sure I'm going to literally be obsessed with these. Always have to grab more chocolate covered pretzels. That is a must, period. Then I got some bread. So I get the organic ancient grain and seed bread. Then I always get cheese and crackers because my boyfriend and I love to do cheese boards and charcuterie boards when we are together. So I always make sure to stock up. Then I got some clam chowder. I love clam chowder soup. I don't know why, it's just a weird thing that I really love. So always get that. Some butter, boring. This green goddess dip. Okay, I've seen TikToks about this dip and I've never tried it before. So I got it because I've been really, really interested in trying it. Then I also got chia seeds. I love to put chia seeds in smoothies and acai bowls. So I always grab some of this when I'm running out. Avocados, of course, I love avocado toast in the morning or putting avocados on rice cakes. This is something new to me. I've never tried this before, but I love green tea, so I wanted to give it a try. It's the blueberry and pomegranate Trader Joe's green tea. Um, mac and cheese, mac and cheese is my favorite pasta, so I always get that. Some lemons. These are the small little like sparkling water, sparkling seltzer types of drinks that I love to try from Trader Joe's. So right now in my refrigerator, I have these strawberry and rhubarb um, soda. So I wanted to give these a try this time. And these are lemon elderflower soda. Always gotta get spices. Always, always have to get everything but the bagel. But this time I also got the everything but the elote seasoning because I love elotes but I hate mayonnaise. So I wanted to give this seasoning a try. And then of course some K-Cups for my coffee because I was running out. Got some mozzarella sticks, wanted to try them. I've never tried a 
Trader Joe's brand of mozzarella sticks, so I wanted to give those a try. Then I got some mashed cauliflower. So I love mashed potatoes, but I know they're really, really bad for you. So I always try to opt in for like a healthier alternative that doesn't really change the aspect of the flavor too much. And I love mashed cauliflower. It tastes exact, to me, it tastes exactly like mashed potatoes. Okay, so this pasta I saw for the first time. I wanted to give it a try. It's linguine with clam sauce, which I just told you guys how I love clam chowder. So I was hoping that if I try this, I will also love it. So we will see. I'm a big seafood person. So this is just like frozen shrimp and calamari and scallops. Like I said, I always get cheese and crackers so I can do a small little cheese board. And this is the double cream Gouda cheese. You always have to get some fruits and veggies. So veggies I didn't need to get this time, but I got some fruit. My favorite is strawberry and blueberries. Then of course, I haven't even shown any protein yet. So I get some ground turkey breast. I get it the most lean that you can get and the least percentage of fat. So this is 99% lean and 1% fat. And then also chicken thigh because that's also less fat and better for you as well. And normally this much protein and meat can last me for a week because normally I'll make at least four meals out of all of this. Okay, last but not least, I got this organic acai bowl. I've seen this on TikTok and I feel like a lot of people like it. I love acai bowls, but they're one, super expensive in LA and nobody has the time to get the ingredients and make it themselves. I don't at least. So I wanted to give this a try and see how it compares to store-bought or freshly made acai. I actually was talking with the Trader Joe's cashier about it and she asked me how I thought it compared to an acai bowl that you get somewhere else and I was like, that is literally why I'm buying it to find out. So if you guys have tried this before, let me know your thoughts on it in the comments below and let me know what you think it compares to if it's better than getting it freshly made or if you can't really tell a difference or if it just completely sucks. So that is it for my Trader Joe's haul today. I normally don't wear a hat in my videos but I am getting my hair done for the first time in a couple months and believe me my roots need it so I'm gonna go off to do that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a huge thumbs up if you did and I am sorry that I have been inconsistent with my uploads. I was out of town for a long time and it took me a minute to get back on track with like work and everything else so I promise I will keep you guys on my two videos a week upload schedule starting next week. I will see you guys in the next video.